Number 1. Moore's Lounge aka Bill and Roots. If you are a lover of jazz music and love to listen and interact with musicians in an intimate setting then Moore's is the place for you. This is not your typical shuttle the patrons in and out after each set type of place. It is a very intimate setting where you have the opportunity to interact and engage with some of the best local jazz musicians and touring icons who come to Moore's to interact with the essence and spirit of the origins of this music. Number 2. White Star Bar. A group of three of us popped in for some dinner after a ceremony at Liberty Landings Marina. We all had steak and it was fantastic. The asparagus was delicious, the potatoes were cheesy and creamy and the steak was cooked to perfection. The service was quick and our waitress was very friendly. I would recommend this place to everyone. Number 3. Corgi Spirits. What an absolutely amazing experience. As a corgi owner and someone who loves gin this has been on my bucket list for quite some time. The drinks and that atmosphere are amazing. Samantha was gracious enough to give us a tour of the facility where they make the amazing hooch and I couldn't be more grateful for it. Number 4. White Star at Harbor. Great dinner stop for us after hopping off the Liberty Landing Ferry from NYC. The bourbon pork chop and the Scottish salmon were both excellent. Happy hour drinks till 7 p.m. Had planned to eat across the water at Harbor House but closed Monday. Think we did as well or better at White Star. Loved it. Number 5. The Lutz Beer Garden. Lutz Beer Garden is a must-do when in Jersey City during summer slash beautiful weather. Lots of food choices. Big selection of beer and other libations. There is a pretty lawn with Adirondack chairs or if you prefer, high-top tables and or long picnic tables that you can fill up to accommodate most group sizes. Number 6. OBS Corner Pub and Grill. Interesting place, it's Irish from the outside, Italian bistro on the inside, with a nice fireplace, pool table. Service was quick and friendly. I tried the burger with all the trimmings plus cheese and bacon, and was pretty good. The fries were especially nice, having a light batter on them, and served piping hot. Number 7. The Blue Note Bar. The Blue Note Bar is a traditional bar at Jersey with a nice atmosphere. However, on one night that I went there with my friends, we were basically kicked out. It was 11 p.m. and we were about to leave when the barman, blue shirt and red tie, came to us and said, get out or I will kick you out. This was a very unpleasant surprise and I hope they seriously consider who they recruit. Number 8. Zeppelin Hall. The spirit of real beer gardens is a gathering place for members of a community to come together. This place has the drinking place down but not the community aspect. Children are not allowed after four and the place was largely filled with dude brothers. The food is plentiful and there are a surprisingly large number of vegetarian options. Number 9. Pub and Grill. This is truly an urban beer garden with open self-service seating along with table service area in a sandy corner. Side area has two cornhole courts. The food is basic fried slash grilled beach bar fare, chicken fingers slash sandwiches, burgers, wings, fries and delicious fresh made huge Bavarian pretzels. Good beer selection. Number 10. Pub Crawler. More than anything, a pub crawl is about doing it all together and sharing a unique experience with others. That's what you get from San Diego Pub Crawlers Pub Crawls. This pub was created to showcase the town's diverse nightlife scene. Visit and become immersed in their belief that it doesn't. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.